Welcome to Headline News 24-7. Please click like and subscribe. Trump rips into New York Governor Cuomo for targeted investigations using AG as personal bludgeoning tool. Donald Trump may be as quintessentially New York as they come, but he's on a political collision course with two of the most powerful officials in that state, the governor and the attorney general. In a series of tweets posted on Monday, the president blasted New York Governor Andrew Cuomo for what he called a bludgeoning tool being used against him. Trump accused Cuomo of harassing his businesses and organizations in the Empire State with Democratic Attorney General Latita James at the center of the controversy. The president mentioned past examples where one of his foundations was sued before criticizing Cuomo and the Attorney General for not digging into the Bill and Hillary run Clinton Foundation, which is based in New York. James campaigned on promises to investigate the president and his business dealings, CNN reported. James's offices will also continue a lawsuit brought by her predecessor against the president's charity, the Donald J. Trump Foundation, as well as the president himself, the three of his adult children, Donald Jr., Ivanka, and Eric. Indeed, James seemed particularly obsessed with going after Trump in a campaign video where she called him an illegitimate president who should be charged with obstructing justice and then removed from office. It is important that everyone understand that the days of Donald Trump are coming to an end, she declared according to CNN. That statement and others like it sure seem to back Trump's point about New York Attorney General investigating a person in search of a crime instead of impartially following real evidence. It's nearly impossible to pretend that James isn't biased after her anti-Trump rants, and that should alarm anyone who values the rule of law and the presumption of innocence, no matter their political party. One of the core principles of our justice system is that the individual cannot be perpetually harassed and investigated just because an official doesn't like them. Round up the usual suspects should remain a movie line, not a legal precedent. The choice is hers, but Attorney General James ought to fully and deeply appreciate that injudicious comments undermine her office and her cases legally and factually and will call into question in the public eye the credibility of her work. Legal expert and formal FBI official Chuck Rosenberg noted earlier this year, whether you call it Trump derangement syndrome or just target fixation, this doesn't seem to be yet another leftist missing the forest for the trees in their zeal to attack the president. It will be interesting to see if the latest crusade from de Democrats in New York gains any traction or just spins its wheels as the 2020 election looms. So far, overconfident figures who try to take down Trump haven't fared so well, and James's past comments do not bode well for her chances. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.